Hey everybody, welcome back to the last part of this week's comic book uh, review, uh, 20th episode, so happy. And now, the tying comic book, only in my opinion, I'm sure lots of you guys are going to disagree, the tying comic book uh, for the best comic of this week is Superman 80 Page Giant, um, it says number one, but it's a one shot, it's the Superman 80 Page Giant. In a year, we have not seen... Superman as Superman. In a year, we have not seen Clark Kent. To actually get this book filled with, <clears throat> I'd say, at least five to six stories of Superman slash Clark Kent. Of course, the first story being when Clark was a child. They always do that in these big issues. They always start off with Clark being a kid, and then they reach out into present-day Superman um, stories. But anyway, even though some of the artwork sucked, I'm telling you, two artists in this book were horrible. It was just so good to see Superman being Superman again. I don't know if DC Comics did this on purpose uh, to get people into Superman again, or if it was just, you know, coincidence that it feels like this now, but to see Superman again, being Superman, to see, like, Clark Kent and Lois Lane, you know, at the Daily Planet, to see the whole Superman fighting, like, a supervillain... It just was awesome. It, this was like the best Superman comic I've read in a long, long time. I'm trying to get you guys like a nice picture uh, of which to go with, go by. And like here, Doom's, uh, Bizarro versus Superman. Awesome. I mean, it, it's nothing. It's something very small. But with what's been going on in the Superman titles, where Superman's not even in his titles, and the whole bullshit of New Krypton... <clears throat> To see a comic like this again, it's like, finally, Superman's back, but we still got to get through Last Down on New Krypton before Superman's completely back in his titles. So, these two are the ties of the week, guys. Uh, the two comics I feel you guys should absolutely uh, pick up this week. Regar last week, actually. Last week's stack, regardless. So, one more time. Let's go through this. Superman 80-page giant. Of course... Being a Superman fan, I'm going to tell you guys to pick this up, absolutely. But I'm being honest with you guys, you'll enjoy the mini-stories. There's only, what, two bad artists, in my opinion. Green Lantern Corps, uh, 46, it's an oversized. Absolutely pick it up, it's Blackest Night, awesome. Supergirl 51, Last Down New Krypton, depending on if you're a Superman fan, I'd say get it. Booster Gold number 30, the last comic Dan Jurgens will be doing great artwork. Coast City blowing up, of course you're going to want to get it, I'd say pick it up. Siege 3, absolute pickup. Huge, huge event going on in Marvel. Siege Embedded, if you want tie, actual tie-ins to Siege, this is the comic you should be getting. Dark Avengers 15, one more comic to go, guys. If you've been collecting Dark Avengers for this long, might as well finish it off. There's one more title to go. Amazing Spider-Man 625 is a pass because I'm telling you, Amazing Spider-Man just isn't good anymore. Deadpool, Merc with a Mouth, number 9, absolute great. It's hilarious. You guys will have... Tons of laughs on it. I'd say pick it up. Doom Wars 2, still kind of slow. Even though there are things going on, I hope that it picks up even more because it's just, I don't know, it's just not doing it for me. It's up to you guys with that one. Avengers vs. Agent Atlas, eh, the story's good. It's fun. It's good to see the Hulk versus the Avengers again. I'd say pick it up for that alone. Prelude to Deadpool Core, number three. It's a pass if you have to pass on one of the parts. Uh, Dogpool just didn't do it for me. Nation X, the final part, I'd say pick it up. It was really good. Got some good characters in this one. Last story, though, has a little bit of artwork. And Dark Stark is number one. I'd say, yeah, pick it up, give it a shot. If you like Street Fighter, you'll absolutely love Dark Starkers too. I'm loving the artwork. And with that, we conclude uh, my 20th episode um, doing comic book reviews, doing the thing, reviewing the things that I've loved for the past... 12, 13 years now, maybe longer. Been doing the, I've been collecting comics since I was like 12 years old. I've loved comic books even longer, even further back than that, but I actually became an Advent collector when I was like 12. Superman was the comic book of my choice when I started, and he was the only comic I was getting. Um, I do hope you guys are enjoying all my reviews. Uh, I have tried different things throughout the 20 episodes that we've been... Um, that I've been doing this. Um, like I said, any questions, any comments, feel free to post it on this video or on my page. I'm always around to check it out. Um, 
Mike's been my director slash cameraman for the past 20 episodes and will be the director slash cameraman. For and I congratulate time. you for making it this far. Thank you. And Amber's been um, guest starring for at least five, six episodes now, I believe. And uh, I'd like to throw a huge shout out to a few of my friends that I've been, I honestly haven't been feeling good. I haven't been online really lately to talk with them. And that's Hooliganism. Anthony James, Lou Thug, um, KJ Hulk, everybody who I've talked to in a chat room before that I'm sorry if I didn't mention your name. I just mentioned a few out of the many, many people that I've talked to. Uh, Black Bolt also. And um, all you guys are awesome. I enjoy talking with you. Hopefully I'll be getting back into onto Skype and get chatting with you guys soon. Um, with that, um, I will see you guys next week. Is Absolutely a big week, yes, Michael. I was about to say, don't forget to watch uh, Pete's Basement as well. Oh, absolutely! Thank you. Wow. I I, 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 I had to tell you. I that's terrible. I'm sorry. Pete's Basement, awesome website, and I watch it too. You know, that's what makes me laugh. I've been watching it, and I haven't been saying it. I didn't say it last week, that's guys. Why I'm a director. But Pete's Basement, check them out. Awesome website. Great guys. Differing opinions on certain comic books. I've noticed we've had different opinions on Last Down on New Krypton. But you know what? They're still great, awesome uh, reviewers. You guys should absolutely check them out, as well as all the other people I've just mentioned. Um, also, I get all my comic books, all these comic books, these wonderful things, uh, from MidtownComics.com. And no, I'm not sponsored. I'm just saying that because that's where I get my comic books. Uh, and that's that. I uh, look forward to a lot, a lot of titles, like I said, are ending. A lot of titles will be leaving this review. A lot of new titles will be coming in. A few other titles I'll be testing out. So stick around. Uh, 20 episodes down. God knows. Millions more to go. So I'll catch you guys next week. we got a big one. We had 14 this week. We're going to have 13 next week. We're just one less than normal. And the only reason we had 14 this week was because of that extra one I got from a few weeks back. Also, might be actually getting Futurama in two weeks. Not next week's review, but in two weeks. Uh, might be starting a Futurama. The Futurama comic uh, might be popping in and out of my reviews from time to time. Huge Futurama fan. Saw the comic. Have to check it out. So, with that, I will see you guys next week. God bless. Happy belated St. Patrick's Day once again. Check out Pete's Basement. Check out Hooliganism, Loot Thug, Anthony James, everybody else um, that I've been mentioning. Go check out Mike, Dude to Rock 18. Go check out Amber, NYS Blue Harmony. Their names are on my page. Um, as far as the people I've mentioned, they are on my subscribers slash friends list. And um, as far as Pete's Basement goes, I know they're not on. They are on YouTube, but I have a, I always put the link to their uh, page on my sidebar. And um, yeah, catch you guys next week with a lot more comic books. Bye. Stick around. Later, guys.